What's up, Scorpio? And welcome to my channel. I hope all of my beautiful and my handsome Scorpios out there are doing well. So, Scorpio, we're going to pull some messages and we're going to see what's being activated for you at this time, baby, okay? So, if anything resonates for you, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel, also comment, let Blue Flame know what's going on. And if you're interested in a personal, my email will be in the description box below, okay? All right, Scorpio, let's go. Messages from my Scorpio spirit. What is being activated for Scorpio? All right, Scorpio, we have universal love, okay? Miracle. Okay, look at all these. Four, 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 three, three. I can't talk, Scorpio. You can be seeing 44, 33. Okay, so universal love talks about it activates the connection that you feel to each other, your planet, and the whole existence itself. Okay, let's look at this, Scorpio. 44. I don't even really never go to this book. Okay, it says, love is probably the most sought after, mysterious, fulfilling feeling that a human can experience. Its mystery surely derives from the fact that we can we cannot really describe or define what it is. Is it energy? Is it an emotion? Perhaps it is simple. It is simply the glue that binds everything together. Whatever it is, we know without a doubt, when we feel loved and we love, we we flow like on a higher vibration, okay? We our frequency, okay? It aligns higher, okay? And this talks about being able to align yourself, okay, with your feelings and your emotions, Scorpio, okay? So I feel like the universe, what's being activated for you, Scorpio, is universal love, okay? Because we all want to be loved, okay, Scorpio? And it's like when you have that feeling of, you know, love, like it makes you feel good. When you feel love, Scorpio, don't it make you feel good? When you feel love, it made me feel good to feel love, okay? And I feel like, Scorpio, for some of you guys, this universal love or this feeling of someone actually giving to you, Scorpio, the same love, same time, same energy that you give to them, Scorpio, for some of you guys, you're going to feel like this a damn miracle, okay, <laughs> with this number 33, okay? But I feel like Spirit is saying, still look forward to miracles, okay? It's going to happen, Scorpio. We all going to receive love. We all going to be loved. And then we all going to be kicking and ha ha a few years from now talking about how we was all stressed the fuck out about whoever we was waiting for and, and whatever was going to happen, okay? But that miracle is going to happen, okay? Let's get a couple more activation cards, and we're going to pull some messages from the awakened soul, okay? All right, messages for my Scorpio. Who is being activated at this time for Scorpio? Scorpio, we have the solar plexus, okay? Look at this, Scorpio. I can't make this up. 333. Three, three. It was the reason why I said 333, three, three, okay? This talks about... Your sense of self, okay? Your personal power, your willpower, your knowing who you are and what you're going to contribute as a whole, okay? So this talks about Scorpio. Someone here, you guys focusing on your willpower, okay? Having your sense of self, okay? Knowing exactly who you are, okay? And going for whatever Scorpio, okay? Or going after like your dreams or whatever it is that you want, okay? You have a deep knowing of what you're supposed to be doing here on this earth. Y'all hear them birds out there? Y'all, there be like a thousand of these birds out here each and every day. And they, when they go by, be like, whoosh. Like, it sound like, <laughs> it sound like a big ass car or something when they like fly by. Like, I be sitting out here just looking at the birds, chilling and shit, man. Okay, messages for my Scorpios. What else is being activated for my Scorpios, Holy Spirit? Integration, Scorpio, okay? This talks about being able to embrace every aspect of yourself, okay? And also, you perceive what is negative and also being able able to perceive what's positive and then find a balance okay scorpio we know everything can't be all good every day but we know trouble don't last always okay and everything is not going to be bad all the time okay so it's like you understand okay yeah shit gonna be good sometimes just like we had good days we know it's gonna be some bad days to follow but you understand like that how that's how it has to be okay that's duality like you have to balance everything you know what i'm saying all right one more Messages for my Scorpios, Holy Spirit. What is being activated for my Scorpios at this time? Messages for my Scorpios. What is being activated, Holy Spirit? And Scorpio, we have Merkaba, okay? This talks about Scorpio being able to tap into your Akashic records, okay? If you're not Akashic, Akashic, however you say it. Okay, that's like being able to time travel, okay? Being able to look back in time, or look, look back on your past life, Okay. Also, you're being able to look at your inheritance, okay? Seeing what things are coming to you this lifetime, okay? What experiences that you're going to have that's going to serve 
your highest purpose, okay? So you could be seeing the numbers 32, Scorpio. Y'all hear them by listen. Y'all, it's gonna be like a thousand. Like they all, I've been hearing them since I've been outside. They just made their way. They just slowly coming closer to me. All right, Scorpio. So let's pull some messages from this awakened soul. They make me feel like I got a hollow over them or something. <laughs> messages for my Scorpio. Let's get some messages from this awakened soul. Messages for my Scorpios. I love you, Scorpio. And if anything is resonating, don't forget to do what? Like this video. All right, let's get some messages from this awakened soul. I'm going to show for y'all. All right. Messages for my Scorpios. Anything for the Messages for my Scorpios. Good. Messages for my Scorpio spirit. What messages do you have for my Scorpio today? Messages for my Scorpio. What does this awakened soul want to say? All right, there we go. That guy, Scorpio. All right, Scorpio. So this awakened soul, Scorpio, realizes that you are everything that they want, Scorpio, and that you are everything that they need, okay? But this is also someone, Scorpio, that realizes that they have wasted too much time okay so i feel like scorpio someone that you are dealing with like they're realizing like they're going through some type of awakening or like it's like they're having some type of tower moment to where you know they realize like damn scorpio is everything that i want and need okay so i feel like someone was unsure scorpio okay possibly because of this connection you know and maybe because this, this connection differed you know from everyone else so this person just wasn't sure you know what i'm saying maybe it was something that you did that made this person unsure. Like, I don't know if Scorpio would do this or do that. You know what I'm saying? I don't really know if, like, this is how Scorpio really is or Scorpio just front. You know what I'm saying? But this is someone, Scorpio, that realized they have wasted way too much time, okay? So whoever this is, Scorpio, they realize, like, it took them way too damn long to come to this realization about you, okay? And this is someone, so I really don't know what I want. Uh, this is your energy, Scorpio. I feel like right now, you know what I'm saying? Since you've been separated from this person and not talking to this person, like you really don't know what you want. You know what I'm saying? You don't really know if you want to be back to this person, but then you don't really want. You really don't know if you want to let go of this connection either. Like you kind of stuck. Like this person been stuck about coming towards you, okay? But you could be over this connection. You know what I'm saying? You may not be wanting to let go because you aren't sure. Just keep it real, Scorpio. Okay? You over this connection, but at the same time, you don't know what you want to do. You know what I'm saying? You confused, Scorpio. It's okay. Look, Scorpio, but this person saying, please take me back, Scorpio. I'm so sorry, okay? This person, I'm telling you, Scorpio, it's like they went through some type of tower moment. Like, I don't know if somebody said something to you or uh, said something to them or it's like they were shown something. You know what I'm saying? But this is someone, Scorpio, it's like, they like, man, like when this person come back, Scorpio, they're going to be begging you, like, Scorpio, please take me back. Like, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I wasted so much time. I I'm so sorry it took me so long to realize, like, you were the person that I was supposed to be with. Like, I'm sorry, Scorpio, okay? And then, oh, so Scorpio, look at this. But this somebody saying they want to have a family with you, Scorpio, okay? But, hell, some of you guys, you may actually have kids, okay? You could have kids in the future with this person, or you may have already have kids, okay? Or, Scorpio, you had kids of your own. This person wants to come in. And, you know, be like that emperor, that empress, okay? Be that father figure. Be that mother figure to your children. I feel like I'm talking to what? Some twins, Scorpio, okay? Look at this, Scorpio. I can't make this up. Scorpio, this person saying you have awakened their sleeping soul, Scorpio. I was like, I felt the energy, Scorpio. See, when you met this person, Scorpio, they soul was asleep. They weren't awakened to spirituality. They wasn't awakened to the great things of the world. You know what I'm saying? They, they, they weren't awakened to this connection. They were asleep. That's why it took them so long to understand, like, Spirit had to come in and do something to really wake this person up, okay? And Scorpio, this person wants to come in and heal this connection. That's why they want you to take them back, Scorpio, because they want to come back and, ooh, look at these birds. They want to come back, Scorpio, and heal this connection between you guys, okay? They know they did a lot of damage, Scorpio. They know they fucked up, okay? But they want to come back and heal. See, Scorpio, you already done healed from this person, but see, they want to come back and help you finish healing Scorpio a lot of us lean through healing you know what I'm saying but it's like when this person they just come back and even give us the closure to just even set us free you know what I'm saying or to even reconnect whichever way it go you know what I'm saying but they want to heal this connection together okay and this is someone Scorpio I feel like both of you guys Scorpio I feel like on this journey of being 
being in this connection with this person, like spirit had to separate you guys, okay? They had to separate you, Scorpio, because you possibly were codependent, okay? Just like this person was codependent, okay? But they wanted you, Scorpio, okay? They wanted the divine feminine to learn how to be by themselves, and they wanted this divine masculine to learn how to stand and how to be by themselves, okay? Not to be dependent on someone else, okay? Not feeling lonely, you know what I'm saying? Even though you may not be with someone, Scorpio, you can feel lonely. Like, being this time, I've been in separation. I've had my ups and downs, but it's like I really don't feel lonely no more, Scorpio. You know what I'm saying? I'm too focused on other things. It's like when you just focus on this connection, hell yeah, you're going to feel lonely because you're missing them. But as soon as you start focusing on other shit, Scorpio, I'm telling you, you, you ain't really going to be worried about it. And that's when shit start moving fast. And when you focus all your attention and energy on one thing, that shit going to take even longer, Scorpio. But when you put your focus on yourself, your business, your career, your finances, your kids, whatever, Scorpio, shit start moving along, Scorpio. I'm here to tell you. I'm a living witness, baby. Let me tell you. I ain't going to steal you wrong, okay? All right, Scorpio. So let's see what signs we are talking about here. Scorpio, we have... Scorpio, Capricorn, Pisces, and Virgo. And Scorpio, we have Pisces, Gemini, Aquarius, and Scorpio, you guys, okay? Even if I didn't call out your sign, Scorpio, if this resonates, baby, it resonates, all right? All right, Scorpio, that's all I have. I love you guys. And until next time, Scorpio, stay blessed.